Okay, here we go. We've got uh, three weeks left before we need to head over to the cold north, but I wanted to do a video update of our place. New roof, new uh, area there for sitting outside. All new stonework here between us and our neighbors, uh, Dale and Kathy. And they got a new roof. Their place is looking awesome. Top closed up. Dale's already gone home. Anyway, so here we go. There's the rental, our plants, there's Rosie and Mr. Prickles and new candy. And Penelope's coming back slowly after the frost. And there's the fountain and the clubhouse that Chris loves so much. That fountain is what he loves. Anyway, so. It's pretty good. It's coming together quite nicely. Let's on this side over here. Next year we're going to do some more window work and uh, replace some more of the windows. Probably these two here will become a uh, one small short one. But from last year we also got all the uh, hurricane shutters on most of the windows. And there's an alley. My big aloe vera plant and Chris ran new sewer line this year. So it's looking good. Paint held up really well. As did the striping. I didn't get around to painting it this year. Ah, maybe next year. Like I said, we got all the hurricane shutters on, which makes a huge difference out here. Keeps the sun off and it keeps it nice and uh, cool inside with the sun off the windows and uh, protects our windows in the storm weather. There's the hibiscus plant that my sister gave us, and there's our welcome to our hive sign that uh, BFF Shelly gave us, and our little patio area out here with our barbecue, and Chris has got a bike torn apart back here he's going to work on, and then this planter here was, well it did have that hibiscus in it, but well I'll put something in, I'll fit it for next year, because the hibiscus wouldn't have survived the summer if it had been in there. So the shed got painted this year, which looks great. And we added a few things in the shed this year. We got a fridge in there this year. And Chris got a fancy new toolbox, which he loves. So we gotta start going through totes soon and figuring out what's gonna make the cut to go home. And then back here, we gained a much larger covered area with the new roof. We, we gained this whole area back here which next year I want to put some little patio furniture out here. I'm not quite sure what yet, but we'll do something back here and then we're going to get a screen door, proper screen door, not just this magnetic one. And then of course the door going into our bedroom. And we're thinking of changing that window out, but we haven't decided yet. We'll decide that next year. And of course the royal palm trees up the side here. Um, this wall is all new. Um, the whole wall was rotted, so whole new wall, whole new windows, both windows are new. The mini split, um, Bonnie helped us get that raised up off the ground. That's much better location for it. And uh, our sitting area out here gained a bee quilted table runner. And cushions on the chairs and a little deck box and things to hold the stuff from out here. And. I painted some of the uh, patio stones. We have be nice or is off. So we're getting there. And this planter here also had some plants in it, but the uh, frost got them, and so I just stuck some bees in there for now for this year. Lots of bees. And of course, our uh, area out here is nice. It's all covered with the. Uh, Clock out here, two new windows there to go to the patio door that uh, wasn't in very good shape. Fixed up all out here. And there it is, it's uh, almost 80 degrees already this morning. It's quite nice out here. And of course, we also have our sign that uh, Bonnie made for us. And then this is Penelope with all the new growth on her. And then Candy, she's new, I had to replace her. The other one got frostbite too bad. Penelope's coming back, and she's coming back strong, so that's a good thing. So anyway, so let's go inside for a tour of what's changed inside. A few things changed. There's one of the big changes. Little Miss Tweak is, uh, is sitting at the door. 
She doesn't tend to like to go out though. She's not interested in being outside. Go on, go on, away from the door. She used to play in her bags. So, changed around this room a little. Um, put the couch over here. Just worked better. And then the love seat over here made room for a litter box. Now that we have a little creature and her little car bed's there. And her food's over here. And her kitchen hasn't changed much. And uh, of course the table, chairs here. Keep the table a little bit different this year. We have uh, the half a leaf up, the side drop half up, and just put the chairs over this way. It makes it a little easier. You have to keep the chairs pushed in because otherwise Tweak is uh, getting up there and she knows better. She finds lots of little interesting places to hide. She likes that little corner. There used to be a bottle of vodka in there that she would get into. Uh, she liked to lick the top on the bot bottle of vodka. She got a drinking problem. And we see you. So of course the storage. It's the same here. Bathroom. And then of course the bedroom. A few additions. There's uh, my uh, Tabitha up there. And 66, my two new stuffed toys. Guts. And I haven't brought that blind down yet, but anyway. I don't think anything else has changed in here. We did have to uh, put a little latch on this door so that it um, can't just be pushed open easily because uh, Tweak was uh, trying to catch things outside and pushing the door open on us. And then down in the Texas room, we added a new recliner for me. The two new windows from the inside, those ones, and those two windows as well. We've also added a small sofa. We got rid of the big sofa bed. Tweak has a little house down here she likes to play in and then we added a, a big screen TV up there so Chris and I just tend to sit down at this end here. He's still in his same chair and I got my new one. Anyway, and of course Chris got some new cowboy boots. I didn't but I got a new belt which I'm really excited about when next dance comes on. Oh Tweak's going to sit and look pretty. See our pretty toes. Those are little plastic soft caps to protect our furniture from the, the claws that someone has very sharp ones of. So we just do a count every morning to make sure all of our toes are there, and then if not, we glue a new one on. They pop off naturally. She's pretending she's a little angel right now. She's not. And then we have the cowboy hat holders here. And over here, the blue one, the sparkly one, is from uh, South Padre. From spring break 2024 with Linda and Steph and Laurie and Vic. We all had a really good time. Anyway, that's uh, my updated tour of uh, of our home away from home. Invested a little more money again this year, but hey, it's all an investment in our retirement. And of course, there's my new bike too. I have Triple B, the Bumblebee bike. So, anyway, sign off for now and uh, catch y'all later. Bye.